As the future becomes the present, technology seems to only improve. An old computer is constantly replaced with a new model. The same could be said about transportation and the slow march towards EVs, electric vehicles. While everyone would want a new electric vehicle for Christmas, vintage car hobbyists, like Santa Clara resident Larry Dalmes, share a different sentiment. Larry has owned his prideful vintage Ford pickup truck since 1986, and him and his truck go way back. I uh, took a few years off during college, and in 1986, I bought this truck behind me for $200 out of the Signal here locally. It had originally been a farmer's truck uh, on a field in Sierra Highway. A uh, teacher bought it, had it for about a year, and then uh, I bought it from him. With the electric vehicle mandate soon to arrive by the 2030s, some hobbyists would find themselves in a worrisome spot. However, Larry sees things differently. From an enthusiast standpoint, I think it's uh, kind of pretty interesting the, where they're going with it. I've seen some programs where they take uh, rec Tesla motors and they retrofit them in trucks like the one behind me. Whether we like it or not, that's the future. While it's quite expensive, vintage car enthusiasts have a chance to turn their cars, like Larry's Ford, into a electric vehicle. That large price tag is sure to change as new technologies become readily available. I would, uh, if I could afford it, yeah, I probably would. Um, it, it, will make, it would make the older vehicles uh, very modern at that point. The one behind me is original. It has a straight six motor in it. And um, they constantly need work and upgrade. It is what it is. It's an old farm truck. And that's the way I liked it. They were, I had one like it in high school. And when I originally bought it, that's what I was thinking of, uh, you know, getting something like the one I had. For Canyons News, I'm Matthew Miha.